This is my friend Dell, and he's got something he's going to show us. What have you got? A nutty device. A nutty device. Look at this. Oh, wow. Let me get in here closer. You want to see the back side? Yeah. Very cool. Want to see the other side? Just a nightmare I built. And it's all made out of wood. Yep. No nails, no screws. All wood, glue, and dolls. That's quite amazing. Hardly know where to point this thing. The only thing is you get tired of turning the track. Well, I bet there are plenty of kids who would like to help you. <sighs> yeah. Wears you out after a while. <laughs> It has four gears working off of it, two on the outside on each side and two on the inner gear here on each side and they're alternating. The top gears on this side work on the outside and the top gears on this side work on the inside pet gear and the side gears on this side work on the outside and the side gears on this one side over here work on the inside gear. See there's a gear on the inner inner part there. You can see it over here. I think I'm getting brain lock here. Right there. Trying to. And then this is off center gear that turns this cage gear uh, at different speeds because it's off centered. It's uh, those different speeds. Yeah. And then of course these are chains and sprockets. And and this is an escapement here. It only turns this only turns one peg at a time from every time this thing comes around, it turns it one peg at a time. And then that operates this, which makes these turn so they roll. Of course, this patterned after a fly ball governor, and it works in this this gear here. It's kind of hard to see. This peg gear works in this holes holes in this gear here. This is just a chain tightener here. And then here's some more bell cranks that work off of a crank down in there. And this is this is a De converts rotary motion into reciprocating motion and then this is one that, another one that works for reciprocating motion or rotary motion into reciprocating motion this device here going around raises this frame up and down different speeds and there's a rack and pinion type gear here this going back and forth with on this crank here makes this go at a faster speed across the bottom than it does across the top because it takes longer to go in this arc than it does to go across the bottom. Yeah, I guess that's about all I've got to say about it really. But I'll turn it some more. It isn't quite done yet. There's some more cosmetics to do on it. Fill up unused holes like this one here. Some more on this side. Well, it was quite a chore to figure out how to build it, design it, make the parts work. Oh, getting tired. Uh -huh. And it all works off of one crank. Yep. One crank, chains, sprockets. And most of it is is so that it can be taken apart to work on. Let's show us that. Yeah, let's see. Let's 
pull that out so we can fit. Oh yeah. Has a transmission. It's made out of various woods. This is zebra wood. This is purple heart. This is a bay tree that was beside my house for a while. Made that. This is uh, Osage orange. More purple heart. This is maple, of course. And I can't quite remember what this wood is. Let's see. I don't remember what that is. I don't know. It's made out of various hardwoods. It all goes back together, held together with pegs. Cool. Some of it says Osage orange there, maple, Osage orange there, purple art, there's bullet wood. This is Chaduka, this is bullet wood there. And this is black walnut and purple heart. This big gear here. Of course, these are purple heart with with Osage orange knobs. These are all black walnut. This is. And of course, these are purple heart and Osage orange things in there. And then it's all held down with wooden screws and nuts. It all holds it. Threaded, threaded rods through the whole works. So you can take it apart. Like I said, it's not done. It's got a bunch of other stuff to be done. There's oak, there's, there's maple, there's all different kinds of woods in it. Uh, there's some shadua, and there's all sweet, there's even hickory in it. Bullet wood, like I say. This is bullet wood here, I think. Oh. Pretty darn neat. Something to drive you nuts, keep you awake most of the night. Give a smile to the audience. <laughs> <laughs> this is incredible thing that you've made, Dell, and you made one before I know of, back in the 80s, middle 80s. Yeah. But it was about half the size of this, and 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 not near the complexity either. No, this is my crowning achievement. I don't know whether I'll ever make anything again like this. You're going to start on another one right away? No.